In a previous video, I showed you how to set up tax rules and rights manually for certain countries. In this video, I'll show you how to do it en masse so you can apply your tax rate to all countries at once using a CSV. You start off by going to Sales and then VAT or Tax. And if I just before we I show you how to do it, if I just show you the Manage Tax Zones and Rights, you'll see at the moment we've got one set up for the United Kingdom and the United States. So to get them for all countries, we go to Tax and then Import Export VAT Rates. Okay, so we can import our file here, that's next. But to start with, we'll just export what we've currently got on the website. So if you do that and grab your download, and I'm going to open mine in Open Office, and have a spreadsheet which looks like this. So you've got your tax code, the country it's applied to, and then if you want to filter it by county or postcode, you can. Then there's the tax rate on the end. I'm not going to worry about the rest of the columns. So what you do is to start with find out all the country codes and all the different countries that you can have on Magento. I've uh, already gone out, my, out of my way to get these um, two letter country codes. You can find them on the internet. And as you can see, it covers pretty much every possibility. And there's our United States one. So I've just replaced what we had before with the new United States one. So every single row has got a country name and then the country code next to it. And it's in alphabetical order. Oops. Never been that good with CSVs. And in here somewhere we should be able to find the United Kingdom. There we go, so it's, it's called VAT, but I'll just change that to United Kingdom. Okay, the next thing I need to do is apply the rate. So I'm going to make the rate, because I sell from the UK, I'm going to make the rate for everybody 20%. And then I'm just going to grab these and drag them to the rest of my rows. like so okay I'm happy with that now so it's ready to import back into the system I'm going to save it to my desktop and I'm going to edit filter settings to make sure that I save it as the right format which is CSV so yeah I'm happy with Unicode UTF-8 click OK now I can go back to my Magento admin, choose the file from my desktop, and then click import tax rights. Then if all goes well, you'll get the green message telling you that they've been imported. So if we go back to sales, VAT, manage tax zones and rights, we should now see that they've all been imported separately. So saves you a lot of time doing them one by one, 238 countries in one go. That's how you do it.